I'm cooking a Dutch oven meal tonight. Guess what it is? Chile Riano casserole. <laughs> I've been requested to make this one last time before leaving the desert so that's what I'm gonna do today and I've had requests from comments to make a video so this is the video so what I've got is hatch green chilies um, cheese ground turkey uh, evaporative milk eggs and I'm going to leave the link to the recipe. I just got the recipe off the internet um, with one added ingredient, which is the taco meat. So the recipe is just calls for the green chilies and the cheese. And it was good. I had it like that, I think, two or three times. But since I added the taco meat, that has sent it over the top, I'm telling you. So I'm going to show you how I make this. First of all, I'm going to cook the ground turkey and add my taco seasonings, which is a homemade taco seasoning mix. And I will leave the link to that in the video description too, because I got it off the internet. I don't buy the little taco packets. Um, I make it every time I make tacos. So I'm going to cook the taco meat. And while it's cooking, yep, I'm going to do this in the Dutch oven. So while this is cooking, I am going to get the coals started. Here's the homemade taco seasoning. Spread this on. Got my fire or my charcoal started. There's my Dutch oven. And I'll show you how I layer the Chilariano casserole. Two eggs, a can of five ounces of evaporate evaporative milk. Um, I don't have any regular milk. And it calls for half a cup of milk so I'm just gonna eyeball a little bit of half and half because I always have half and half so it's just gonna be a lot creamier and some two tablespoons of flour the butter green chilies won't stick and it's just a layer it's a casserole these are whole green chilies you just spread them out on the bottom of the pan of course you can do this in an oven it doesn't have to be a on charcoal in a dutch oven but you can do it in a rv oven or at your oven in your house Just gonna cover the bottom. Okay, this is the part that I've added. This was not in the original recipe, but this is what made it a much better casserole. Chilariano casserole. This is ground turkey taco meat. And half of the Monterey Jack cheese, half of the cheddar. You add another roll of the chilies. While you wait for the tomato sauce and the remaining cheese, we're gonna let this cook for a little bit. And then I'll be back and add the tomato sauce. All 
Okay, I'm gonna add the tomato sauce. And then we'll let this cook a little bit, warm up. And then I'll add some cheese and it'll be ready. Are y'all ready to eat? Yeah. Yes! Yeah, there we go. All right. And I just rotated the bottom, so. You always wanna rotate your cast iron or your Dutch oven because you don't want to get hot spots on the bottom or the top. I'm going to add a little bit more. I'm not going to get, make any more coals though. Thank you. Thank you, camera woman. See, Dub's journey is doing the camera work. Oh, look at that bubbly. All right, last step. Put the rest of the cheese, let it melt, and then it's time. That's how you spread the cheese out. The coals are done. I'm done. We're all done. We're ready to eat. Still needs to melt a little bit, but we won't eat right now. We're hungry. Who's up? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mmm, yum, yum. Yum, yum. That looks good. Yep. You got string hanging off your plate. Mm -hmm. Ooh, yum. Next. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You're going to give me a taste test? Uh-huh. Okay. I can do that. You got cheese hanging down, too? Oh, there we go. That was the Jilly Riano right there. My charcoal is pecans on it. Oh yeah, you need to put raisins and pecans on it. Oh my god, I will. And sour cream. Mm. <laughs> I will. Oh, look at this picture. <gasps> that is so good. And guacamole. Oh yeah, I made guacamole too. I didn't film that. Oh, those green chilies are delicious. Are they? My face ought to say it all. Yeah. Even without the other stuff. This is delicious. Thanks, C Dub's Journey, for the purchase of the chili riano casserole or, or ingredients. Enjoy, everybody. Because mm -hmm. I know we do. Mm -hmm. Thank you for cooking. Mm hmm. Yeah. <laughs>